This exercise could be for the tyres you've got on the sprayer at the moment and the potential tyres you're looking at purchasing. So we've got all the information, all the weights and boom folded, unfolded, tank full. Now we need to go and do something with that information. And we've recorded what brand and model of the sprayer. Obviously the Miller Nitro and the model 4135. It's got a 105 foot boom, 6,000 litre tank and 128 inch tyre centres. And we've recorded the weights, boom folded, tank full. Front was 6670 kgs, rear was 9,070 kgs. But the real important one was boom unfolded tank full and front axle was 7,110 kgs which gave us 15,642 pounds. Rear axle was 8,530 kgs, 18,760 pounds. And why we need the pounds is that's what we've got to enter into the tyre pressure calculator website. The tyre size is 520, the ratio is 80, the rim size is 38, the load rating is 172, and the front axle weight was 7,110 kgs, which equals 15,642 pounds. The tyres are R3, R4 type tyres, so that'll be fine. Select application, we're going to be going spraying at about 15 mile an hour. Spraying. Okay, we're using singles and calculate. So that gives us 17 psi, obviously for the tyres in the front. Right, just go back and we'll enter in the back axle weight because all the other figures are the same obviously, 18,760. Enter. So we need 17 psi in the front two tyres and 23 in the back with the boom unfolded tank full. Right, to summarise all we've been through, our main aim for this is to reduce our tire, put the tyres on and reduce our tyre pressure for the impact on the soil and boom stability. And obviously wear and handling of the sprayer, that's, that's the reason we've gone through this process. And from experience, Ash and others have noticed an improvement by going through this exercise. You might hit a few blank walls when you ask the questions, but work through it and it'll be rewarding.